Hi, I'm Matt. And I'm Tom. And we are on a pub there. Hi, I'm Matt. <laughs> <laughs> I am from Yorkshire, but I live in the South. People in the South think I'm Northern. Yeah. People in the North think I'm Southern. Yes, and therefore everyone hates you. Yes. Could be worse. I'm from the Midlands. I'm from the East Midlands. I'm from near Nottingham originally, which is neither north nor south. The, the River Trent, which goes through nearby, is meant to be one of the borders between the two. And that means I'm, I'm northern enough to be considered a northerner in London, southern enough to be considered a southerner in Yorkshire, and again, everyone hates you. And if we were speaking to a Scottish person... They... yeah. We're, we're bloody southerners. Yes, yes, we are. Sassanax, I believe the term is. Ah. And there is a north-south divide in the same way that there is in the US in, the he in a heck of... Heck, uh, got away from me. Heck of a lot of countries. <laughs> <laughs> heck of a lot of countries. <laughs> including um, Chandler. Yes. Britain has a north-south divide. Now, I think the reason... I, I can tell the reason for northerners thinking I'm southern and... Yeah. Go southerners it, go thinking it. I'm northern is my accent. Because it's reasonably... RP, explain that. Received. Oh! 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 oh. 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 Winstrom, Winstrom. <laughs> Received pronunciation. The Queen's English, BBC English. Carry on. And as you know, I can speak a little bit like this. <laughs> as Prince Charles with constipation. Sorry, Mummy, would, would, would you mind passing the toilet roll? It's not quite enough. <laughs> Mummy. <laughs> oh. Actually, the, the Queen wouldn't pass a toilet roll, she'd just pass a corgi. <laughs> I think the brown marks on them are from. That's a heck of a joke. That's a, that's a joke you can't get away with many royal families these days. They'll get me shot in some countries. Sorry. <laughs> Southerns. Southerners. Uh, yeah, so I sort of speak a bit posh, but I also speak a bit northern in it. <laughs> so I will say bath rather than bath. Yes, because that's one of the big, the big differences. Um, garage rather than garage. Yep. Uh, and, I, and I'll do exactly the same. Yeah. Because uh, I grew up a little bit in Yorkshire, but mostly near Nottingham. So I've got this weird accent that very few people can trace. There's a bit of Mansfield in there, which is a town I grew up in, which... Mm, um, <laughs> it's, it's, it, I shouldn't insult my hometown. <laughs> but he's but going to. I just to. did. <laughs> um, no, M Mansfield, I, I, it, it produced me. It's, it's a relic of something that isn't there anymore. Yeah, it's an ex it's, well, it was never a mining town itself, but it was surrounded by mining towns. So when, the, when, the, when Maggie Thatcher closed down the mines, as the story goes, uh, yeah, it, it was not... It was not uh, anyway, moving on. But I accents do a lot in the UK. So yes. they, they, I, th I think um, you can, accents are so much more regional in the UK than they are in the US. And in most of the world. People can tell the difference between, say, a a Hull, a York, a Leeds, and a yeah. Huddersfield accent. And They're all Yorkshire accents. As a translation, I, that's like telling the difference between a, a Houston and a Dallas. No, it's like a Dallas and a Fort Worth accent. It's like if those two cities, which are now one big city, had different accents. It's that kind of distance. Yeah. But that's actually getting less these days. Sorry, linguistics. I'm taking this over. That's fine. Go for it. Clunk. Linguistics degree. Uh, the internet and increasing travel has meant that accents are starting to spread out and merge. Mm. Uh, 50, 100 years ago, you could easily tell the difference between villages on other side, on different sides of a river. Uh, if you're in some regions of the UK, now, no, it's all spread out. There was a thing I saw, I can't talk about this in detail because I can't remember it much, but I think I'll try and link to it below. <laughs> uh, I think it might be on one of the BBC pages where there was a survey of accents between the 90s and 50 years before that. Yeah. And there are audio recordings of different areas. Is it not BBC? Is it Cambridge Uni or something? It's probably, yeah. But yeah, Yorkshire, presumably. Yeah, and you can... The wind's changed, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you can see the little strap oh, yeah. from my camera. I'm going to move that, sorry. Thank you, Shenley. Hey, I've brought the microphone with me. Yeah. So no matter what Tom says, <laughs> I can talk about him behind his back. By behind his back, I mean right in front of him. Okay, I'll come back now. So coming with me, adjusting my trousers as I sit down onto this chainsawed bench. <laughs> 
we, where were we? we we carry on with what we were talking about and why am i it's because i've got a mic isn't it yeah <laughs> yeah um, accents and stuff right yeah say, say that again <laughs> yeah accents and stuff right yeah so it's, it's a north south thing bath bath garage garage things like that are the big differences yeah. that, that apparently change somewhere about the river and i'm from york right. which has both people that speak right yorkshire yeah right right yorkshire right, right. <laughs> and then the other half which speaks sort of more like what i do <laughs> <laughs> thank you ernie wise <laughs> second obscure reference to this stuff, right? <sighs> a lot of professional works in the south isn't it and a lot more manual works in the north yeah. Um, industry, industry. Was, industry was always in the north because Sheffield is steel yep. uh, what else is there Coles to Newcastle there's actually an expression Coles to Newcastle which means it's a stupid idea to take something there they've got too many of them already um, the north was always industry <laughs> I wasn't miming that I was actually off balance um, the north thanks Shenley <laughs> Finley <laughs> um <laughs> The, the north is always industry, the south is always um, uh, top work. hats. And, yeah. <laughs> and it's not quite that. I mean, mining was in the southwest as well, yeah. and Wales was always mining. But the kind of southeast of England was always where the money was, and still is. Yeah. I, I saw a, a, a wonderful example, I've read a wonderful example, I'm going to have to try and find the reference, which said to explain what London is like, it's kind of the centre of, of Britain to Americans. They always complain that Washington is in the news too much because it's where the politics are. Yeah. Imagine if, if Washington also had Wall Street, which is in New York, and Hollywood, and Silicon Valley, and they were all in one city. And anything you... It's got a little bit better recently, but anything you'll see on TV or in the news will be in and around London or this... You're watching a cooking programme, and they'll say, you can get, um, I don't know, like, kaffir lime leaves in your local supermarket. Yeah, no, no. You can, in London. Yes. Because London's very multicultural. Yeah. There are pockets of the rest of the UK, are, but generally yeah. it isn't. And... You also, I mean, there are other places that stuff gets filmed. Manchester now has Media City. Glasgow's got a few BBC's things. BBC shipped off half of its operation to Manchester, so you'll now see London and Salford High Street. Yeah, but the, in, all the independent companies get bonuses for not filming in London. But they don't normally do it because... <laughs> They're based there. It's too much effort. They know London. Yeah. It, it's, it's, it's bad. And, and let's be honest, we both moved down there for the jobs and the work. Because the media industry is based in London. Yeah. There's uh, pockets of it, but... And all the places we're going to be filming for the next few park benches, because I'm imagining this is the last one we're doing in Shenley. Thank, thank you, Shenley. <laughs> it's going to be this kind of region, isn't it? Because it's where we are. It, <laughs> we, it's not like these are sponsored. We're doing it yeah. out of our own pockets. There are many attempts to revitalise the North. Hell, I, I spoke at Thinking Digital for many years, which is a conference up in Newcastle, Gateshead. Uh, and they were all saying, yeah, we've got startups up here, we've got tech companies... Uh, we've got everything up there, and they have. Yeah. But they've got enormous amounts of development money to try and make that happen, because if they don't, they're all going to move to London. Because where else do you go? But the one thing that the North has better than down here is a good fry-up, good fish and chips with yes. mushy peas. That's true. Black pudding in the fry-up. Yep. If you want... If you want Pies! Flat caps, whippets. I'm going for all the stereotypes going full here. Yorkshire here man. <laughs> the Yorkshire dial just got turned up. Oh, man, I can't make those jokes. I'm not from Yorkshire. All right. <laughs> By the way, flat caps and whippets, not for eating. Those are, those are, those are for wearing and, and. My caps are not for eating. <laughs> no, you don't wear ferrets. What do you? I was going to say ferrets. ferrets. What do you do with whippets? And they're dogs. They're dogs. So, all right, you, you breed whippets and you, you and ferrets go up people's legs. Up people's legs, yes. yes. <laughs> You've gone full northern. <laughs> that's the north-south divide in Britain, anyway. That's, that's, one of the things, that's one of the things that someone asked us to cover. Oh, was it? Yes. Cool. Well, we'll find you afterwards and put you here. Uh, you know what? I'm not going to find them. No. <laughs> there's going to be a big thing there saying sorry. <laughs> anyway, whatever you want us to comment, like, next... Put it in the comments after this one. Uh, Hit subscribe if you want to see our videos and know about it. If, yeah, I, I, like, it's, 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 let's be honest. It's, 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 sorry. <laughs> I like doing it because I find it funny. Because <laughs> I, I don't feel like a vlogger. I know we're vlogging, but I don't feel like a vlogger. <laughs> we, vlogged, we vlogged all over Shenley. <laughs>
<laughs> and she's not happy about it. <laughs> old man river, <laughs> that old man river.